They got all kinds of great things on display. Are they painting this thing? And engines, I'm sure, are not going to be ever used again. Take a look inside. Huh. Uh. All right, the entrance is in the back. Wow, they got a lot of junk. Probably recycling this stuff. All right, so it's 23 miles to Coos Bay. I'm thinking I probably want to go to Coos Bay for an auto mechanic now. I don't like BNC. So they got a lot of poles out here. What do they have? Look at that. It just goes right on out. I think that says bicycles are encouraged, right? Oh yeah, that's the stuff. Oh, that's da it is pretty dangerous for bicycles getting in between the cracks and stuff. Wow. Yeah, this is falling apart. All right. Whoa, haha, <laughs> that's pretty. So what's the deal with this? There's concrete on the top even. Looks like concrete. <clears throat> that was one dangerous ride. Probably the most dangerous uh, out of all the docks I've ridden on, which aren't an incredible amount, but... That's pretty cool. Looks like this hasn't been used in a while. That's a, a fix up. So this will take me to the end. It feels like my hat's about to fly off too. So I don't think I want to go very far. So a lot of these businesses are closed for the season. Muddy flats. Yep. <clears throat> Jesus. All right. <clears throat> All right. Just taking a look around. It looks like I can go to the end of this pier thing. Well, people over there. <laughs> All right, yeah, it's gonna talk about the nature. No poop. So there's nobody here. Oh, it looks like they stop you short of the end. They don't want anybody further down for some reason. So deal with that.
Know your fish. He's in driftwood for a fence. <clears throat> Somebody may have died on the road. Is this in dedication to them or is this just art? There's another one. They took the clothes off this one. It looks more like art than. Yeah, because there's one on the other side. <clears throat> Trying to be artistic. They're not white bikes. I thought I saw a pier. Yeah. Is that accessible? Looks like it's totally blocked off. Yeah, that's a part of some kind of private property deal. U.S. Coast Guard cable crossing? Hmm. This is an old pier, probably for a company. Far a person has to go around this bay just to get to the other side for that bridge at the very least. <coughs> All right, just to check out that, that uh, lighthouse. I was up there on that ridge looking down and everything. Some kind of a painting inside this old building. Try to create a scenery. Uh, they had ambitions for this area, but a lot of people pulled out. See, people as a reference for size for this lighthouse too. There's a, there's a person. So, it's not a very large lighthouse. All right, so Blue Star has information. You got a Coast Guard, which is interesting, but I just wanted to start off just by looking at the Army stuff, which is actually not, not, not easy to see. Wow. Uh, they just patrolled the ocean. They patrolled the beach during World War II pretty much. Yeah, all this water is not helping. Alright, on horseback. Alright, so the turkey just jumped up into the tree. See what's going on. What's it gotta do up in that tree? There's two turkeys that walk around this library. Not sure where the other one is. Okay, so yes, this type of exercise is socially unacceptable. But, it really works, the, the butt, okay, and one of the great things about it is that it's improved uh, the, the swelling I was experiencing every day. Um, I don't have it so much anymore. 
So it's it's been a great benefit to uh, improving the blood flow, or I guess you could call it the lymph the lymph flow uh, to my my feet. All right, that's been the single most important thing to improving the the swelling around my ankles has been working my butt. So I think there's going to be a big tendency and. I mean, in my opinion, from my experience, there's probably a tendency for people who have weak butts, small, flat butts, to also suffer from from uh, swelling in their ankles as well.